Bro, you was doing all the talking, you was giving all the lip all right, and the you smoke know what? and the no. fashion. All right, and then, cool. then After now, this, now you're this, now you're, no, you're giving no, all the smoke. Let's not ruin it. Yeah. We're, we're having a, I actually, I'm quite enjoying this. I'm having a I, great time. I actually time. feel like I'm, I'm actually in therapy right now. And I feel like you're, 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 you're bringing me to a place I haven't been before. So let's not ruin it. What's going on, people? It's your boy, Michael Dapper, and welcome to Break Time. This is a show where I connect with different sports figures from around the world to discover how they break away from work. So we're kicking off the series with a Gillette Lab special today. He's the boy from Brent, England international, Gillette ambassador. He's clean shaven, sharp on and off the pitch. It's the one and only Raheem Sterling. Well on, my guy. Good bro, how are you? I'm good, you right? Yeah man, thanks for having me. I appreciate you bro. I've heard that you're like a, a proper like fashion man. And that's your thing that you, you love to do away from being on the pitch. Is that true? Yeah, it is, it is true. Why are you acting shy? <laughs> Man's going, sh yeah, yeah, yeah. I always try to dip my, my hands in all sort of little pots and the fashion ones, what I kind of like, and it, it, gives me, it gives me joy, man. I just wanted to play a little game with you called No Delay. I'm just going to say a word or a phrase, and you got to tell me the first thing that comes to your head. No delay, you can't, like, you know what I'm saying? Straight. Yeah, it's just like how you are on the pitch, strike. <laughs> you understand? Just, all right, cool. Kingston. Jamaica. Okay, okay, okay. You're ready for this. <laughs> Simple one, that All right, all right, all right. We're, just, we're just warming up, bro. Bunda. Chunks. <laughs> <laughs> London. Wembley. Rolex. Watch. Protect. Watch. Okay. <laughs> Hairline. Mad. <laughs> That's the hairline mad. <laughs> Drip. Drown. Plantain. Plantain. No, no, it's plantain. Plantain. You told me to say what I wanted to say. Let me say what I was saying. Why you got to add no, no. when I said you plantain? You say plantain, I just said plantain. All oh, right. So let me see what I got to say. The pat, the pat was started coming out. Next you question, say plantain. <laughs> plantain. <laughs> Gillette. Me. Oh, hey, okay, 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 okay. <laughs> Home. Bed. Family. Everything. Ah, oh, that's beautiful. No, that's beautiful. Now that, that's beautiful. Lionel Messi. Ronaldo. Ooh, Ronaldo. Messi. Brent. Harold. Okay. I think we're ready for this. We're warmed up. Warmed up. What are you actually been doing there today? So today I've been shooting a TV commercial for Gillette as an ambassador. You've been shooting a TV commercial? Yeah. What, in? Inside. You know, it's always been like a dream of mine to like, you know, be in a shaving advert, but you know, my beard's always been invisible. It's been, you know, insufficient. <laughs> But now, obviously, I've got a bit of um, visibility. As the face of Gillette, I might see what strings I could pull. Don't gas me up. Don't no, make us go inside. I'll do my best. No, but the maddest thing is... Yeah. No, no you can be here, sir. Is this all it goes? <laughs> is that all it goes? It don't go past that. This is my beard, bro. Oh. Like, no, no, but no, hey. <laughs> Man's proper shaped it up as well. <laughs> Why shouldn't I shape it up? Let's go, man. I can't believe I'm here. This this is brilliant. Is this what you're using the advert? Yeah, that's the exact same one. Exact. Can I get a different razor? <laughs> I don't want the same razor. This razor is nice though. This is nice. What's the steps when you're when you're actually like on set? How well, do you... normally, obviously, I've got the abs out, eight pack. I think Raheem can be flex about me. <laughs> you know, usually I've got my eight pack out. I'll show you something about some packs. <laughs> Mud. So is there like a particular way that like I'm supposed to shave? I think for that one, I've got the right person. Who's that? Um, with the right expertise for that. Let me come in, bro. Let me come in and check what you're doing now. Thanks. What's happening, bro? Yeah, you look buff. Thank you. <laughs> Ian, with your expertise, mm -hmm. um, looking at Michael's beard, how long do you think it will take to get clean shaven? We, we could probably take that off pretty quick, bro. So r r r what we, can, we can make this smooth quick. How long does it take to shave yours? Not long, in fact kind of grows in the same patchy way. What's so, so special this is, about this? This is good, man, because it's got the exfoliator here. Yeah. This one kind of smooths it off for you so you can go down nice and effortlessly. Let me try it. I, I, I just want to try it. I want to try a little. For oh, okay. goodness so, sake, just see. get that off, man. What's that? Then fluff. Where's the fluff? On your face. It's on your chin, bro. <laughs> Are you taking off the moustache as well? Nah, 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 nah. Can you see the moustache? The moustache is lit. <laughs> it's thin. Let's use a quick rinse. For the what does the quick rinse do? It comes off quick. <laughs> <laughs> That's it there. Is this it? Yeah, that 
a bit more, and then the other side. Has he got, has he got a towel or something? Can we get some towels, please? Some towels, please. If there's anybody that don't need to be behind camera, all right, can we give us some space? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I want to actually make the ad, like how you do the ad. OK. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do it. OK, camera's up. Camera speed. Three, two, one. Action. I keep looking at yourself like, yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna shave myself. I feel good. Yeah, I feel good. <laughs> are you are you gonna take off the chin then? Nah. Uh, okay. Been growing that for a while. If you don't work with me, okay. hey. Yeah, bro. I'm just trying to. I'll I'm take just... off your hat, bro. Seriously. Okay, bro. <laughs> don't mess around with me. What's this stick called? That's the exfoliating razor. Exfoliating razor. And then smooth. Remember, you have to go down to where your actual hair is as well. Remember yeah, your that's what not, I'm doing. Your beard's not that high up, so go down a little bit more. Yeah. Go all the way down. Hold on. Who ordered this guy chicken? <laughs> <laughs> I'm so confused. What's hey, going wait, on here? The Come on, you got me talking. Wow. Not bad. Yeah, that's not bad, you know. Wow. How's that feel? Nice? Yeah, it feels nice. Very nice. Yeah? Yeah. This is the, the end of the advert, so this is where you have to do the tagline. Three, two, one. Go. Gillette, the best a man can get. I just got it. <laughs> I love that. And that's a wrap. Yeah. Can we have a round of applause? Yes. 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 That was special. That was very, very special. Now, I've got something for you. I want to take you through over there. And let's go have a bit of fun. I can't lie, you're looking clean still. I'm looking clean. Not you, bro. No. Uh, <laughs> 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 what was you meant like that? Bro? <laughs> no. Not, you. Not you, bro. I know that everyone here is a bit of a fashion head. We've got our two models here. Yes, bruv. Yes, bruv. Right? Bro. <laughs> <laughs> and me and you, bro, we're going to go head to head. You're going to dress. Sorry, your name, sir. Can't touch you. Oh, you don't talk, sorry. And your name? You don't talk, though. All right, so that's bruv one and bruv two, yeah? <laughs> so you're going to dress bruv one, and I'm going to dress bruv two. And Ian, you're going to be the judge. OK. But do you not think it makes more sense that the two guys that can dress to have a Bro. thing and then you judge? Bro. Bro, yeah. I've got... I'm a stylish man, you know? Let's see it then, bro. Bro, don't... You got style, bro. I dress myself. <laughs> yeah, in the dark. <laughs> <laughs> It's worn now, for real. Yeah. Well, are like these that. their size? What they're... size are you? I think you, you can't. Are you a large? Can you respond yes or no? Just look at him, man. He looks like he's about a large or an extra large, man. You can see that. Look what? at his chest. You didn't want to get people that can talk. I like this jacket, though. <laughs> Move, man. Bro, give it. What, what are you doing? <laughs> What's that thing? That looks nice. It's a little cream joint. That's a nice one. It depends on what trousers you put with that. It depends on whether he fits into it, bro, because he's a big guy. Did you go gym and that? I heard that still. Do you want us to turn the lights off? To help you. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a laugh out of Bruv One, bro. Bruv One, he you're cracked. not allowed to laugh, bro. You get fired. <laughs> you will get fired. Do not laugh at when he says stuff. How, what colour um, trousers are you going to go with that, that brightness? Hey, is he allowed to push me when we're I doing this? He's actually pushing me. I didn't push you, bro. Bro, that's a yellow card. You do that again, mate, you're off. You look like you're ready, Raz. Yeah, that... I'm ready, man. It's easy. This is for you when you're ready, innit? The trousers, they don't have any trousers that's gonna fit you. But you're gonna keep on. <laughs> you're gonna keep on your trousers, bro. You can take this. Bruv one, you can follow him. Hold get, on, wait what there, about, wait what there. about some glasses for me? Yeah. Well, I just picked up anything out. No, 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 this goes. Oh, no. It goes. I'll show you a real fashion. I'll help you to your. Nice one, bro. Yes. I like what, what you're doing there, Raz. He's nice. like he's a store assistant. Don't make go. him get extra points I'm not, for that. I'm not. Let me know if you need anything else, alright? Who dresses you these days? No, man. Because just... you always look fresh. Dress myself, man. That's beautiful. Because you know, like back in the day, you used to have a high top. Yeah. Now you got no top. You got yeah. the convertible yeah. thing, yeah? Yeah. So. <laughs> did you know? you got the, the what? Thing? The convertible thing. Yeah, I got the convertible. I took the top of the Maybach. Yeah. You, know? <laughs> you go to the barbers and just. Ask nah, for man, like I did a, it myself. The bowling. Yeah. Yeah. Is it? Yeah, just. That's you just used that, the Gillette foam yeah. for that? Yeah. Seriously? Yeah. Wet shave it, yeah. Wow. It's a clean shave, man. So it does the face, it yeah. does the and top the of the head. Yeah. Yeah, it's the best. Smooth. Brother Raz, when it comes to breaking away, what kind of things actually help you just like 
with your mental health and just making sure you stay on top of the game? Um, meditation. Meditation. Mm. At a younger age, I was something I'd have never thought I'd have been doing. It's been put in front of me mm. before, mm. and I just used to laugh, yeah. laugh at the people that used to come to. Yeah, you're big man. Meditation, yeah. you're, you're yeah. a good one. Yeah. And yeah. then you, you realize how um, valuable these things are, and a little walk in the park with my dog mm. and my son is like the best feeling in the world. That feels like you've done the utmost, like you've mm. had the best summer holiday, you know what yeah, I mean? Because yeah. you're just refreshed and charged. What, what did you used to do, Ian? Or even now, because you're, yeah, you're still active. I get a lot of um, pleasure in um, going shopping and going with my girls. As long as they're doing well, yeah. I will literally buy them anything. Yeah. Because I think that what you've got to make them understand is that if you work hard, I would reward them with what they want. Mm. But they have to work hard. No, because my, my manager, he's got a daughter and he said that when it comes to like little girls, mm. it's hard to say no to them. Is that the case? Yeah. Is it? Yeah, yeah. When you have a little girl, it's like you've got a friend for life. I better hurry up and start producing. <laughs> <laughs> Need to start their productions, you get me? I've seen you obviously talk quite passionately about like people ha being allowed to have a break away <clears throat> from the pitch and stuff mm. like that. Why do you actually think it's important? Especially in football, it's, it's all consuming. Everything's football, you know, everybody comes up to you, they're talking football. It, can get, it gets into your head, it's intense. Mm. Especially when you're playing at a, a, a club, an elite club. If you haven't got something that can give you the release, from the pressure of football, yeah. it will consume you. You have to have something different. This is why I love when the guys have got something that they're doing. I'd love to hear that like, Raz's got his, like, his line. And why, why is it important for you? You get to, the, as Ian said, a top, top club and it's demanding every three days. There's been numerous of times, there's probably, I'd be honest with you, the last 10 years, I think I've celebrated Christmas three times with my family. Hmm. Wow! Yeah. yeah and yeah. These Three times? Yeah. Probably like three, four times max. In 10 years? <clears throat> in 10 years. Yeah. Wow! Like Raz is saying, you have to leave on Christmas Day and it's horrible because like when your kids are young, your kids are crying when you're leaving on Christmas Day. Mm. Your kids are crying. You've got to go and then you've got to go and just deal with that. That's something. And it's yeah. always a constant battling and it's only last two and a half, three years that I've actually said to myself, it's impossible that I would let this continue. Mm. Do you know what I mean? That at this moment in time, I got, can't think selfish. Um, and anything I do now in football, you know, with my move um, back down to London, everything's for my family first and foremost. And then, you know, anything, it, football comes after that. So that's how I live my life now. And um, before it, was, it wasn't like that. It was literally mm. just football. And I realised, as, as Ian was saying, it it's consumes at times and you start to get it starts to get a bit much, man. Mm -hmm. that, that's beautiful. <laughs> so that's, that, beautiful. that's beautiful. That this this is a family, man. But don't get it. Still yeah. love it to the. the no, no, no. You, you love, yeah. Listen, don't try and spoil my moment. That was beautiful. <laughs> that yeah, I would hug you if I could, but I need to stand over here because we are competing right now, so I can't hug you. But that <laughs> is beautiful. <laughs> Let me just get my W, please. Bruv one, bruv two. You ready? Wow. Jeez. Wow. Chase! Your shoulders is mad. <laughs> What's this called? The trapezius. Well, I like Brother One's jacket. Personally, I would have had a tighter T-shirt because the jacket's doing this, it, it, enough. But I like the blue of the N catching the face in the jacket. I like the sleeves on this. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's nice, huh? And then it got. I think you've done well with the. Um... Sixteen ninety-two. Yeah. Is that what it is? Is this? Six, this is cool, bro. Bro, this is a tough one. It's a tough one. But if, if you can just take in the fact that the, the lenses of the glasses blends in with the clothes. He looks like Morpheus. <laughs> bro, nah, the, the, the no, no, glasses no, no. He looks like Morpheus. I like, I like the glasses. The glasses, glasses, the glasses are cold, like, this is like, like, those glasses are high. <laughs> when you got the dark face, you need a, you need to have a, a frame you can see. So it's yeah. silver or gold frame. Let me see. Much better than your one. I'm gonna, I'm probably, I'm gonna have to go with bruv two. Come on! I'm gonna go it's with bruv two. It's ring. Congratulations. It's ring. In fact, I can't give it to you, bro. I'm gonna give it to you because. Thank you. I love this jacket. It's beautiful. I it's love this jacket. Absolutely. I think it's done it. It's what's finished and, and, it And you me. know, it's the colours. The colours just go so well together. And you know what? This is a nice look, but you, I don't know what's going on with your shirt and chain there. Big man, just straight. Bro, leave man alone, bro. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I just want to say uh, a very big thank you to Brav2 for your stiffness of your neck and the movement that you did when you went into the, um, the changing rooms and for how you came back on so well. Um, the, what's the problem, Raheem? 
Big man, fair one. That's my intro. Let me tell you why. No, no, no. Big man, let me show you something. Let me show you something. What are you actually doing? First and What are you actually doing? I designed that jacket. I designed the jacket. I've won both ways. You know what I'm saying? You couldn't lose. Yeah, yeah. I've done reverse psychology. Reverse psychology. You're not that smart, right? You're not that clever. Anyway, yeah. That was a test. And from the test, Ian has proved he can dress. Bro, you design it. This is very impressive, bro. Right, you've got to get me one of those tops, bro. Very well. And this is the kind of things that I'm talking about. The fact that you do this in your break time. Respect. Respect. Big up, bro. Nice. Big up. No you job know? business. Clean shaven, <laughs> clean dressing. Clean is clean. <laughs> Gillette, the best a man can get. get. <laughs> All right. Unks, thank you so much for coming. Pleasure, man. I appreciate you. We've got to do our own one separately. Okay. Keep the gold tooth glistening. <laughs> Are you listening? <laughs> Big respect. Chest to chest. You know what it is. Hey, bro, relax with your grip. <laughs> relax with your grip, bro. <laughs> you know, naturally people sip and paint, but we're gonna drink and draw some of these fruits whilst we discuss some of your highlights and your lowlights so far. You good for it? Give it a go. Yeah, let's give it a go, bro. How was it? For you, it's the moment when you actually scored your hundredth goal in the league. That was a highlight for sure. I said it was a really passionate moment for me. It was wonderful, man. Do you remember the actual goal? Yeah, nil nil penalty. Hold on, were you, were you usually the penalty taker though? Uh, no, not for that day. I wasn't. Okay. Oh, but you took charge and said, "I'm kicking this, bro." <laughs> Ran like I was gonna blast it. Yeah. And just passed it down the middle. Clean. Clean. I am actually an artist, you know. What, you think that's lit? Bro, we just slapped red on the... <laughs> yeah, don't worry about that. On the board. Sorry to cut you. Is this to wash the thing? I was about to ask, is yep. that to... You can wash this. This is our drink. Yeah. This is the drink. Like he got Kool-Aid, bro. You wanna sit? <laughs> Playing in the finals in Wembley. Oh. Yeah, last year. Looking back now, is it a high light or a low light for you? Um, I'd say a bit of both, man. Growing up in Wembley. Yeah. You know, I've always dreamt to at least play there. So to actually play at Wembley and just seeing everything that from where you used to shop, from where you used to hang out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, all of them little stuff. It was it was nice, man. How did, how did your family feel? Yeah, my mum my mom didn't even go to the game, man. She told me she needs to stay home and, and pray for me and all of them thing there. That's what's up. Um, but yeah, they, she was buzzing, giving away every ticket to every Tom. I can't say the other one. <laughs> <laughs> of course, it is always about winning, but sometimes, you know, those memories can, you know, still be positive even if you, you do lose. What would you say was the, the negatives? Of course, not getting it over the line, winning. None of us went to that game to try and lose it. Yeah. You know, we were all disappointed, so, you know, with what followed after was a bit, a bit disappointed, man. What was that feeling um, the first time that you got called up to play internationally? What was that? How, how, how was that for you? Was that a, it was a crazy, highlight? A crazy, bit? crazy. No, for sure that was a highlight. Them times, there was a lot of players that I watched growing up. Gerard, yeah. Lampard, Rooney. Yeah. So like now you're in the big league. You're, yeah. you're with, with the big boys. There's no more messing around now. So I think it was a, a real humbling experience. Right, you know, I dipped my paint in the, the juice. Have a sip. <laughs> Did they embrace you though? Like, you know, the Gerard, Rooney and the... Are you all right? Are you all right? Come on, who's pineapple down? Bro, you was doing all the talking, you was giving all the lip all right, and the you smoke know what? and the no, fashion. All right, and then, cool. then now, this, now you're this, now you're, no, you're giving no, all let's, the smoke. Let's not ruin it. Yeah. We're, we're having a, I actually, I'm quite enjoying this. I'm having a I, great time. I actually time. feel like I'm, I'm actually in therapy right now. And I feel like you're, 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 you're bringing me to a place I haven't been before. So let's not ruin it, all right? You're the one Don't that, go back and forth. Let's... You're, that, you're, that, yeah, 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 that, Oh, no, okay. no, let's go, let's yeah. go. When you moved to Liverpool, yeah. at 15 years old. Yeah. Was that like a highlight for or a low light for you? Cause, what are you, you in year 10? Best time of my life. Yeah. Ever. Is it? What? Bro, I was 15 years of age, bro. I walked into training one day and someone said to me, you can't train today. I said, why? Well, Liverpool's just bought you for this, this and this amount. Wow. So I'm walking with a little swagger in my step. That period there taught me a lot to know what makes me tick and what brings me off, off track. Mm. That time alone really uh, made me mature quicker, man. How is it when you now knew that, okay, cool, I've got to move from Manny, come back to London? Was that a highlight or a low light for you? Um, definitely, I'd say definitely a highlight. I never thought I'd be back in London. Is um, it? Yeah, I, I always thought I'd end my career.
career somewhere else. Mm -hmm. It was something that I never thought I'd have done, but mm -hmm. I'm, I'm so glad I've done because, as I said, I've got you know, my family to, to think about their mm -hmm. happiness as well. So I think all in all, it was something that made sense for everyone. Yeah. You know, I'll be playing at a top club. Yeah. My kids would be next to all their, their, you know, their grandparents and cousins and all of that. It's kind of nice to, to be back home, man, and just kind of have them in your, your roots as well. One thing that um, I know that you're quite passionate about is the foundation and the things that you do off the pitch. The um, Raheem Sterling Foundation, the moment that you launched that, you know, was that a highlight? Yeah, it was a highlight, man, yeah. for sure. Mm. Uh, with my foundation, it was about helping underprivileged kids in, and disadvantaged backgrounds. Mm. And it was similar circumstances that I faced myself. There's kicking a ball in the back of the net and then there's yeah. what actually makes you happy. And 100%. that's one of the things that makes me happy. You know, if I, if I can help in any way, that's what I'll try to do as much as I can. I love it, man. It's been a beautiful conversation. Have you enjoyed yourself today? Especially this bit, I really enjoyed this, but I'm gonna actually start doing it. What, painting? Or not? I actually quite enjoy this, bro. Yeah, it's fun. It's fun. Obviously, I know that you're a table tennis guru, so I thought, you know what? Let's get you something that's gonna help you. So, um, guys, can I get um, Raheem's gift, please? Thank you. I was right behind, oh, I knew that. I knew that, just to help you while you're on your break time. Let me try, could I see us, amigo? Jeez. Don't, don't worry about the pink, you know what I'm saying? Don't worry about that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, I seen this when I thought it was a picture of me and then I seen this. Yeah, sick, 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 sick. This was legendary though. <laughs> Bruv, you know, that's an old, that, that, they're so bad. That's an old, that, I don't even look like that no more. Oh, sick. Now, thank you for that, man. Um, also, I've got a, a Gillette hamper for the audience as well, so I think that's something that we can give away for sure. That's very, very nice. Thank you. We're gonna do this again, away from the lens. For but, sure. For sure, for <laughs> sure. Oh, you don't wanna see the paintings, don't you? Just tell by the pineapple. Bro, just let, let us pineapple. know in the comments who you think has won. Anyway, big up, Ian Wright. <laughs> big thank you to Raheem Sterling. Thank you to Gillette. Thank you to you guys for locking in. I'm gonna put in the description how you can get your hands on that hamper. And I'm gonna see you next time Peace and love secure the package. Man's in a Gillette advert. Gillette Labs, quick rinse, shave foam. <laughs> Exfoliating razor. Gillette, the best a man can get. I just got it. Gillette, the best man can get. But did, you, did you just do that with your chest? <laughs> did you just do that? Yeah, indeed. <laughs> indeed. <laughs> I appreciate that. You made. Right, I need to. Wait, wait, wait. Sorry, I'm just drinking my hand. Now. <laughs> wait, sorry, sir. You can't shake my hand with the chicken in Bro, I had a chicken bone in my hand. <laughs> but so you're not reading my thing? No, it's all right. I so told you already. Gonna, is there going to be edit, some... Edit that out. Can you get some, some water? water? Some we water. need some water. Yeah. Hey, my man. What, are you in all the adverts as well? <laughs> <laughs> Three, two, one. Action. <laughs> <laughs>